Sister Nell said anything about Sister Nell. Amen. <laughs> so let's give Sister Nell Johnson a hand. She's our director of Christian education and she keeps everything together. Oh, who am I missing? I, I miss Rose. Our new youth director. Oh, the youth director of the youth system. Our youth is not doing it today. That's what we kind of do in the county. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Mr. Well, thank you, Sister Zell, and thank you all Christian um, education um, persons for serving. You know, it's not easy to prepare to teach God's word every week. Amen? Because um, every time they prepare, it's um, like they're preparing a sermon for their class. It, it's um, life-giving lessons because a lot of times we learn stuff from Sunday school that carries us through life. And if you've been in Sunday school at any time in your life, I'm sure you learn something from a teacher or from some instructor that you use later on in life because they're life-giving lessons. You know, there's no better place to be for a kid that's in Sunday school. Amen. You know, where they can get to learn how to live life. It's more than just, um, life is more than just, you know, ABCs and arithmetic. You know, when you get on the street corner and you confront somebody that has a bad attitude, what do you do? Then I'm going to ask you to add something or look for um, perfect English, amen? What do you actually do? But these are the lessons that we teach our kids and teach the adults in Sunday school. So I thank all our uh, educators for um, serving and continuing to serve, amen? amen. And um, I want all of you to come to the altar so I can pray with you right now. All the Christian educators. And this is not an easy job. If you think it's easy, I will challenge you to try it. Amen. But it is very rewarding. Because I guarantee if you want to do this, God will bless you. And you never know what you can do until you try. Because God put it in you. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for these Christian educators and we ask that you would be with them, Father. And keep them anointed, Father, and keep with a fresh anointing, Lord. In season and out of season, Father. Lord, we ask that you would keep them in good health so that they can continue to expound your word to just their class of all ages. Lord, we thank you for their hearts, Lord, that are willing to serve in this fashion, Lord, to educate others um, in the way of the Lord. We thank you, Lord, that you would continue to give them wisdom, Father, so that they would be anointed from on high, Lord, to look to others, Father, to just stretch their knowledge out in the life of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So, Lord, we ask that you would take these Christian educators, Lord, and we set them aside for you so that they can continue to serve you and bless others in their work. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, let them continue to rebuild our community. Amen. God bless you.